Ah, what is good, YouTube? Ooh, man, I feel great. Yo, there's... Yo, isn't this lineup, like, really fucking insane? Like, yo. I love Rolls Royce Lamborghini lineup. Anyways, gang, what is good, YouTube? What is good, guys? Welcome back to another vlog over here on the channel, guys. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to... Oh, shit! Make sure to give it a like, you know, a little thumbs up, guys. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck? Weird. Anyways, what are we about to do today? Today? Who knows what we're gonna do today? Hmm. Who knows? All I know is this this car needs oil change. So we're probably gonna hit Brayman Rolls Royce and get that oil change. And let's see if we can get a car uh, for them to uh, give me for... Oh shit. I'm gonna see if they can give me a car for a rental. And uh, I gotta get my ID. You gotta show them 25 here in, in like Miami. You gotta be like 25 to get a rental. So I'm gonna drop this thing. I'll be right back. Oh my god. You're getting fine. I'm, I'm back. <laughs> I left my fucking passport at the crib. Um, well, my identification because I don't have my ID on me. I lost it. Uh, so I gotta use the. Uh, I gotta use the passport to show them I'm over 25 years old. But yeah, Miami's fuck garbage, bro. Like there are a lot of people that won't even let you get a rental if you're not 25 here. In other places, you can pay like a small fee and stuff like that. Like when I went to Texas and I got the Aventador, uh, I paid, well, I didn't really pay anything to be honest, shout out to them. Uh, they actually gave me the car for, for free. I just had to promote them on, on TikTok and uh, Instagram. But anyways, we're picking up JP Savage right now. Then we're gonna pick up Dr. Dollar. Uh, what are we gonna be? Yo, this guy is so funny, bro. <laughs> He's like standing on the side like a hooker, bro. You guys ever seen uh, GTA? Yeah, how much for the hour? No, the audio. Uh, how much for the hour, bro? How much for the hour? Then at least three hundred dollars. <laughs> Just drive by this guy really quick. I think he's more that way. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't see him. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I look you knew you were gonna What's up, vlog buddy? It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we actually gotta go uh, back to design district. I just realized that, I forgot about that. So we gotta go back to the design district because Dr. Dollar, <laughs> we bought matching shoes, right? So whatever, they gave me my 43, 43. Yo, this game, they gave this man one pair of shoe, bro. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, yo, he got one shoe, brother. The, sh the shoe that he tried on, they forgot to put it in the bag. <laughs> so we gotta go get his other shoe, bro. <laughs> this, this guy, bro. Look at this guy. Yo. <laughs> look, look at what, stuck in the, stuck in the ground. <laughs> yo, he shit himself, bro. <laughs> yo, we. <laughs> ah! Yo, we came to Panas to get some breakfast. <laughs> We got to the other side. Come back. <laughs> we out here recording booty. <laughs> All right, gang. So we just got some grub. Oh lord, <sighs> she was fire. Anyways, yeah, I'm a little full. I'm, a little, I'm not even cap, bro. I had two cachitos de tequeño and a fucking empanada, bro. I didn't leave shit. So right now we're on our way to Brayman Rolls Royce to go drop off the car. Hopefully we can get dropped off the car now because I called them and you know, and they're like, oh, you got to come in here, blah, blah, blah. If you don't have an appointment, it could be kind of hard to get you, you know, a loner. So <sighs> what the fuck? But um, anyways, let's see if we get some type of fucking good luck. Either way, I don't plan to leave the car there if they can't give me a loner because we squatted right now. So I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna be Uber Luxing either, bro, because I need a fucking car. <laughs> so let's see what's up, gang. Hopefully we got some fucking good luck. And if they can't give me a loaner, I'm just gonna have to do an appointment and then come back later when they can give me a loaner or whatever. Cause I don't know how long it's gonna take. And let's see what's up with the rental business. Uh, I know there's a car rental right across the street. So I mean, I'm not gonna fucking I'm not gonna pay for a fucking rental of hundreds of dollars a day when you know. 
I drive a fucking half a million dollar car and it's included, you know, with the service. So, I mean, let's go see, let's go hustle them, boy. Come on, damn savage for the win. Come on. Look at that, boys. We got a fucking Rolls Royce. Dude, can you record the Rolls in the back? Where is it? Jeez. Ours is better, though. Simple. That shit crazy. <laughs> Yo, humble yourself, bro. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can get this dude. Hold up. Let's see if we can get this dude from here. It's just, it's just murdered out black. Man, man, that shit fire. Hey, that shit hard, bro. I ain't even okay. that one, the uh, that one is a, that's a phantom right there, boy. If it was a, new, if it was a 2021 phantom, it would be worth more than my car. Yeah, phantoms are worth half a mil, like 520 grand right now. This one was 450 plus tax. So yeah, it's a pretty hard ass phantom. I ain't going to bat. Black bag. No way. Yo, you heard that JP? You know how many options there is? Yeah, there's like 2,000 options. 2,500, damn. Damn, guys, this is pretty dope. Yo, I feel wealthy here. All right, gang, so I actually have a really good idea. I was thinking about trading the Cullinan for a Phantom, but then I'm like, yeah, you know what? Why would I do that when I can just sell the Cullinan and buy this whole entire fleet? <laughs> <laughs> All right, gang, so we have to come back, actually. Uh, we have to come back, actually, on Tuesday because they're gonna remove two little dents there also for me. And uh, if I leave it now, I gotta pick it up like Monday type of vibes. So it's better if I just come back on, on Tuesday so that way I can leave the car and then pick it up the next day. And then on top of that, then basically, boom, I get my dents out, car wash, everything good, everything chilling. And you know the vibe. So now, right now we're gonna go to Design District, help uh, this guy get his other shoe back. <laughs> he has only one shoe. And then after that, gang, eh, we're just gonna, you know, we're gonna go to Prestige Imports and we're gonna take you there, gang. So let's go. Well, guys, we're here waiting for the stores. Oh my God. <laughs> Yo, it's bleeding. Yo, let's go. Yo, GJ is bleeding, bro. I'm so pissed I didn't call the sales at 400. And I literally called him. Yo, look at her, bro. So Yo! My TP4 is 153,500. Hello. Did we go get that guy? <laughs> <laughs> JP's a pervert, bro. Anyways, uh, <laughs> we, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta. JP, stop! <laughs> she is kind of bad, though. She is bad. We just. Wow, well, come here! Be in my pocket! <laughs> no. <laughs> well, we gotta wait till 11 and the store is so fucking open. Yo, give me your shoe box. Let's show the camera what's up with your shoes, bro. Yo, know, $400 shoes at a design place, bro. $450, $500 shoes. I don't know how much they were. I got the same ones, though. They're so fire. You want me to open it? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Man. Show them the shoes. Dude, I am fucking sad, actually. <laughs> I get home, I'm like, yo, mom, look at this shit. <laughs> yo, he goes home and says, mom, look. <laughs> look at this fucking shoe is. <laughs> this one, like, how do you get this wrong? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah this isn't funny. <laughs> hey, so we gotta wait, gang. So I just and the right shoes, two right shoes. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Yo, that shit's hard, bro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, a Lambo. <laughs> Yo, yeah, I'm telling you, bro. I keep seeing that color everywhere, bro. There's a fucking baddie right now feeding this stray cat. Like literally feeding this stray cat, bro. Baddie as fuck. Let's put the... <laughs> Get out of the fucking way, you pass... Man, she, she, she double, she double caked up, double cheeked up on a fucking Friday afternoon, bro. All right, guys, so the original plan was to take Dollar to get his shoes changed. Man, you can't take me nowhere, bro. Like, I can't go shopping because I'm one of those people. <laughs> like, I'm literally one of those people that, like, if I see something, I'm going to buy it. 
You know what I'm saying? That's why I work hard for. And that's one thing I want to talk to you guys about also, guys. Like, you guys got to keep in mind, bro. All the hard work, all the all the effort that you guys put into doing something, you guys always have to reward yourself. You know what I'm saying? This week, I didn't have a really good week, to be honest. Like, all my trades hit 15 pips profit and then, you know, hit break even. And then they went back to stop loss, basically. And, uh, you know, like I felt a little down about it. You know what I mean? There was a range every single day. There was a range. You know, London's... Damn, you just got pulled over. You know, New York session was fire, you know, but yo, London session every single day and it's been arranged. So, you know, what? I felt really bad about it, but I'm not going to sit home. I'm going to cry about it. You know what I mean? I'm just going to go out and do something that, you know, makes me feel good. So, you know, we dropped a little $5,000 again in shopping. You guys just saw my vlog <laughs> and yo, and you guys just saw my vlog, like literally that I just posted today. Today's the 21st. I dropped $6,000. So literally dropping $10,000 in a week on fucking clothes, bro. God, and I don't even leave the house anymore. So like, yo, like imagine, bro. <laughs> but anyways, we on our way to Prestige uh, Imports right now to see what's up with the cars. You know, I wanna see what they got there. You know, I got a shit ton of equity in this car and if I see something worth the upgrade, then you know, we're gonna take advantage of it. But anyways, gang, we'll see you guys at Prestige Imports. Look at this fucking wide body fucking chode right over here, dude. Yo, this thing's insane. All these cars are insane. Yo, insane, insane, insane. Yeah, that's the showroom, guys. JP got a fingerprint on this. No, you fucking didn't. Well, damn. Look at this. They got these things in here like they're fucking Toyotas, bro. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Anyways, gang, the camera is dying, so I'll take you guys home and show you everything that I bought at the mall. And, um, yeah, I'm gonna just fuck around over here and... Let's see what the fuck is going on. Sheesh, dude. Yo, insane. Insane. Wow. Wow. But anyways, gang, I'll see you guys around. All right, gang, so we just made it home and we have this little, little mess over here. <laughs> uh, Okie dokie, let's show you guys what I bought. Uh, actually, let's go clean the office a little bit and we'll do it in there. Jesus, I'm tired. Anyways, gang, let's show you guys what we got. Starting off with number one, Balenciaga. Just kidding. We'll do that. We'll do that after. We're going to do Gucci. Just kidding. We're doing Louis. <laughs> what do we have over here? Gucci's next. Hey, let me stop. So what the fuck is this, actually? This is a nice packaging. So over here, as you can see, we got a nice little package. And we have inside some new swim trunks. So these are fire, right? Because they have like, you can kind of see the camouflage a little bit, a little bit, you know what I mean? You can kind of see them better in the daytime. This lighting is not so the best, but they have the Louis Vuitton print. These are swim shorts. I had the Dolce Gabbana ones, guys. But those, unfortunately, don't fit me anymore because I got a little chunky. Those were when I was like a 32, now I'm like a 33, 34. So they are a tight fit. Now we have Gucci. Now let's see what we got at Gucci. I don't remember what I bought. What the fuck is this? Oh yeah, guys, I bought some socks from Gucci. So actually, let's open this up really good. We have, bam. There you go. We got some black Gucci socks and some red Gucci socks, guys. Each pair of socks was an estimate of 140, book, 140 bucks each. Got two pairs here, black and red, fire. So that's $280 right there. Does this have a price on it? Let's see how much this was. I don't remember, I just saw it and buy it. You know, I don't really like to look at things. But uh, over here, what the fuck? Did you not take the price? You not put in the price? Yeah, okay. I don't know. These were about six hundred something dollars. Seven? No, these were seven hundred eleven after tax. I remember because I was like seven eleven. Yeah, I remember now. Ah, oh, Jesus, guys, it's hot in here. Okie dokie. So now we have, bam, Gucci. Wow, look at this, guys. So let's actually. Open this up here. This is really nice. Nice packaging. So this is actually a new collection, guys. 
tell me these aren't fire, guys. Look at these shorts. With these, with these, with these sandals and those slides and those socks. Yo, fire. So these shorts are pretty dope. All right, next. Over here. Oh, yes. These are my new sandals. Everybody knows I don't wear Gucci shoes. I own almost every good, nice, decent pair, in my opinion, what I think is of Gucci slides. And these are the new ones, guys. Ooh. Look at that. I got a little bumblebee action going on over here. So these are super beautiful, man. Wow, I'm super happy about these. You have no idea, guys. Oh, those are so, so fucking beautiful. You know, I had to with that one. Let's put this over here. And over here, I actually got the same pair for my girlfriend. Uh, for wifey. Now, guys, remember the, the, the shorts that we got from Off-White? We actually bought the matching hoodie to go with it. So this is pretty freaking dope. Over here. Yeah, let me just set this down right there. Wow. So we got the off-white logo in the back. It's literally just a finger off. And then we got the stripes here inside. And then we have the same print on the shorts right over here. I guess he's kind of like a Let's see better lighting. I don't know. It's a little painter. Whatever. So this is a fire hoodie that we just got too. Very excited about this purchase as well. Now I got the matching Fitbit. Ah, married all on me. And then we bought some Amiri jeans. Oh, let me just. Sorry guys. Sorry. Oh Jesus. Oh. I own like four pairs of blue jean Amiris. But I don't own a black pair, so these are actually kind of new. Uh, they're pretty freaking dope, look at that. I don't know if you guys can see that. Sorry guys, I'm, I'm struggling here. Oh my goodness. Bam. Let me just... So these are black with little printing on it. Yeah, these are fire skinny jeans. These are about a thousand. Sweater was about 700. Sandals were about three something. Hey. Yeah, guys, spent like five grand today. But, you know, it's not about the money, guys. If you work hard, you gotta treat yourself one way or the other. Bam, we just got these as well. Oof. Look at this. Look how beautiful these are. I'm excited about these. Wow. It's so beautiful. So we got these and then we got some of course you know i had to we got we got a matching balenciaga shirt for it miami balenciaga of course and then of course you're the, <laughs> you're you know we had to get the socks so this was about 2700 at Valencia. How much was this? No, 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 1700 actually. 1700 at Valencia. And that's pretty much basically it, gang. So we spent about 2100 at Gucci, 1700 at Valenciaga, 700 at Louis Vuitton, a uh, thousand at Amiri's. And $700 at Off-White. I think that's pretty much it. I don't know if I left something. But anyways, it don't matter, guys. So there you have it, gang. I'm going to end this vlog right over here. And like I said, guys, I really couldn't take you into the stores because they don't do that for privacy. But um, anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed the vlog and you like, you know, me giving you guys more of this content, you know, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comments what you guys want to do below. I want to start giving away shit to random people on the street as well and picking out lucky people to start giving stuff away. So, you know, guys, just show some love and then, you know, I'll show some love as much as I can to you guys. Let's get it, gang. I'll see you guys in the next vlog.